Hello, I think it's been about a month uh, since my last video about traveling in Central Asia. Anyway, I was in India for three weeks in August. I took a flight from Bishkek, Kyrgyzstan to New Delhi, India. What I first impression of Delhi is a super mess. I would say totally different from all of the country I have ever been. I mean, of course, many things was interesting for me. People, food, clothes, what else? However, especially on the street, when you cross the road in India, you must be really, really careful because the cars never care about people. And of course, they never follow the traffic right. And New Delhi is the most polluted city also I have ever been. <coughs> I talk. My voice is shut now. <coughs> Another thing, Delhi metro is super cloudy in the rush hour. Actually, many times I couldn't get on the train. So I just escaped from Delhi after a couple of days to Rishikesh. Rishikesh, right? Yeah. I forgot to take my ticket. 450 rupees. 450. Oh, okay. okay. Rishikesh is in the northern part of India and it takes about 7 hours by bus from Delhi. Rishikesh was like really heaven, especially if compared with Delhi. I was feeling like calm and peaceful there and of course beautiful. I learned yoga in a class which was actually hard because it was my first time and my body is not flexible. But after the yoga class, I felt much healthier than before which was nice and I did many things in this cache. Where are we going? We're going to a waterfall. And we got all our friends. We can show them all around. Let's go check it out. Then I went back to Delhi to take flight to Goa. Goa is in South India, such a beautiful coast town. I met some friends in the hostel, then we was riding scooters on the coast road around Goa. Finally, I headed for my last destination in India, which was Bangalore. It took around 12 hours by a sleeper bus, but I couldn't sleep well because the road was quite tough. Wow, nice to meet you again. I met Shitara again. Actually, she's my special Indian friend. It had been a long time since she visited in South Korea. She has been to South Korea for traveling, then I showed her some beautiful place in South Korea. It was our first time met, so that's why I chose Bangalore for my last destination. And I was so glad to see her again. I met again Shitara in India. Actually, I also, I, I also didn't expect that I come here. And next day, I went to Iskun Temple, 
which was huge and most popular temple in Bengaluru. I really like the architecture design and atmosphere of the temple. It was not allowed to take any picture, but I was filming for a little bit. So this is how I traveled in India. To be honestly, India is amazing and the funnest country I have ever been. You know why? No, so actually, I don't believe you. No, 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 no problem. I'm trapped there. You don't pay money. My next video might be about behind some stories of trouble in India. See you next time. Oh, now heavy raining. I don't have umbrella. <laughs> I don't know what should I do, just carry on the walking. Uh, my life always fucked up.